Guys, we, the only thing that I think of when I think of this intro to the vlog is that TikTok noise with Nicki Minaj. I took some, I took some time off, but now I'm back. We took a little bit of time off from vlogging just because we were spending time with family in Reno and Napa and it was really nice just to be really present and not even think about picking up the camera to vlog so we missed it but it was good for us and now we're home it's november and it's 90 degrees it's 90 degrees right now yeah not even joking and we're just in the thick of it for you know starting the holiday season so it's been a little chaotic I'm trying to get in the holiday group too we have one one afternoon with Christmas music? Oh yeah, we listened to a little bit of Christmas music because I was out, I was filming um, a YouTube video for holiday outfit ideas and I just needed, needed to, to yeah, I needed to know what it was going to be like, kind of, so. Yeah, so then we're also actually on the topic of holiday. Normally we don't get a Christmas tree till after yeah. Thanksgiving. It seems like season's coming really early this year yeah I think last year it was like that too and we learned the hard way because we went to get a tree and we couldn't get one because they were all sold out they were sold. well we got like the last one. Oh no one yeah. lot we went to yeah that's they right the first lot we went to that you guys saw uh, was sold out and then the second one did have mm -hmm. one but they were almost have gone too yeah so we're debating going like yeah in the next week or so which would mean we'd have a tree before Thanksgiving which is not the normal way we do it but Different times. Different times. Are you into it? Yeah. Well, also, I don't know when we're going to go home for the holidays. So, yeah. if we're gone for a long time, um, it would be nice to, to be, like get the use out of it, I enjoy guess. Enjoy the tree, yeah, longer. But, yeah, I don't know. It's so much work to decorate our house. And then if we're not even here, it's kind of a waste. Yeah. I mean, I feel like I also normally don't get into like the Christmas spirit spirit until mm -hmm. thanks after Thanksgiving. I know. Right. But if we get the tree, then it's like, well, you got to be in the Christmas spirit. Mm -hmm. You got to get it going. Mm -hmm. So yeah, that's it. I don't an know. I can thing. decide what to do. Like, should we just Christmas tree or no? Should we just say F it and just go I feel like decorate we should... my grandma's house? Because that's where oh. we're going to be the whole month. Probably. Oh, I thought you were going to say go F it and just get the tree Just i don't know i don't know what to do okay here's the thing though we're gonna be here until mid-december what's the date today no like december 15th will probably be oh uh, you think yeah okay probably which means if we got a tree in the next week we'd have it for about a month and then like we get the use because we like to decorate yeah, our house that's true no let's and do we it. think it's cute and we decorate well i thought it, maybe we would be gone for nice. the whole month of december no i don't think that's happening yeah we already have people coming maybe here maybe it would we already have people coming here to say, like oh yeah so true when i smell I like that i look like the the chin guy <laughs> the crimson chin mm -hmm. um yeah so i think we should probably get our stuff I think so. I gotta make my list too. Um, a naughty and nice list. Okay, but in today's vlog, I was gonna do a mini Urban Outfitters haul because I ordered a bunch of stuff from there. And I just wanted to, like I haven't tried any of it on or seen it, so I thought I'd just do a little yeah. collective haul. And then um, the box has been in the garage for a while and spiders are always in the garage and I'm terrified of spiders. So Clayton's gonna help me get the box to make sure there's no spiders and then We'll do the haul. Oh, the old spider check. I love you. I got you.
We're gonna set up a tripod and I'll try on some clothes, but first I just have a couple of little shoes that I picked up. Some loafers. Oh, those are sick. You like these? Yeah. Kale's gonna love Kale? these. No, Don't no. show them to Kale, he'll take them home. <laughs> they will not fit. You gotta wear these on Thanksgiving. I do. Oh, they're so cute. So cute, they're like so chic. Stuff like this, you know, makes you want to move to New York. Doesn't it? Yeah. I don't know how these are gonna look on me though. I feel like sometimes the loafer isn't the right shape for me. That's it right there. I mean, you're, good. you're good to go. It's cute for you? That outfit right there. Yeah. I don't, I don't know. I mean, I did. I do like them, but I don't think they're right for me. I feel like they would be really cute on other people too. I feel like something's just not right about them. Those are no. Then I think this pair is for you, babe. I picked yeah, these out for you. You know, I always get you stuff. I'm very thoughtful. I feel like I didn't get you this color, but that's okay. What are those? Fuzzy birds. Green. I know, but I feel like I didn't get you that color. Fuzzy Bergs. I think you bought it. Is that cool though? Mm, I guess I should get you that color. Kind of a cute color. Now that I know I did it. It's super cute though. Yeah. Before I'm like, I hate that color. <laughs> oh, here's another pair of loafers. I kind of like this pair better. Well, that looks just like Kale's. So. They're like a little chunkier, not as... I don't know, they are still narrow, but they're just a little chunkier. Cute, I think you have to wear them with socks maybe. But I just thought it would be a nice um, like winter fall shoe for you to like slip on. Yeah. Very nice. Oops. You have to buckle them all the way down. Very nice, very, very What do you think? Yeah. With your new little blue sweater, sweatshirt? I just don't know if the fuzz is yeah. the move for me. I know you're obsessed with fuzz. Mm -hmm. He doesn't like the fuzz. Okay, these don't, don't even know. fit. So this I don't is know if fuzz is my move. That's kind of sad. Like I think if these were normal birds, I'd be more into it. Oh really? So far I'm striking out all across the board. Fuzz is really not my bad. Oh, but I love fuzz for you. Okay, these were a rogue decision. Whoa, dude. Let the strikeout continue. <laughs> Are you, what are you doing? I got these in black too, but I don't think they arrived yet. I just wanted to what know. What are you going to do with those? I felt they were so cute for holiday. But they're so chunk. Sometimes I think you order stuff. I just got to know, With you an know? alter ego. Mm-hmm, I do. I don't know who she is. Literally. I think she's with us right I, now. I like that for you. I like that you do that. But then it's like, dude. Yeah. Where are you going with us? I'm going somewhere. <laughs> going somewhere. You going grocery shopping? Yeah. Okay, can you quickly try on for us the jeans I got you? Yeah. So, Clayton's favorite pair of jeans from Urban Outfitters, or I should just say his favorite pair of jeans is from Urban Outfitters. And they're black. They're the skate jean, I think. They, they fit him so well. They look so good on him. I think like for his body type, um, they're really good. I've been needing a solid pair of things. So I got them awesome. in blue. Oh, you love them? I love them. Are they, they too short so or it's good? No, that's, uh, that's how I like it. So we got them for him in blue. These are awesome. You love them? Yeah, these are such a good pair of jeans. No? I don't know about those. Okay, but I like the shape and I also ordered them in black. So maybe the black is the, like, could stay. Maybe the black could stay. But I don't see those really going anywhere. Okay. Out of the house. That's fair. I don't really wear red, but I wanted to know because it looked like a really unique red. It's kind of orangey and I don't know. It just they felt, are a little orangey. felt really fun, but I, I get it. We have to be more practical in this household. <laughs> Voice of reason is here. Me? Yeah. Or your, your real ego. <laughs> is, it, is it alter ego and real ego? Or yeah. Alter ego and ego. Or just all the ego and see maybe I want the Okay, so we just striked out all around the board. Maybe I want the for your jeans. You just want the Arizonas but without the, want the Zonas. These are the Arizonas, but with us. This is actually like maybe gonna turn into your fashion jeans. Uh oh, here we go. You see my end on it? Yeah. Oh my god, my tags are gonna I'm giving the birds one more try. 
see, like, that's so cute. They're just so cozy. I actually really do like the green. I was being a... Why do I order green? Oh, wait, I order green? I love green. Uh, it's, like, so cute. I have, I see the vision again. Why do I order green? Oh, I love I understand the vision again. Oh, I see the vision. I ordered a bunch of jeans because BDG are, like, my favorite jeans. They're from Ribbon, obviously. So I got some cute new styles in those. They're turning into my favorite jean, too. Seriously. The two jeans I wear the most are. Oh, I got a low-rise pair of jeans. That's kind of crazy. Okay, Burke's round two. Okay. I just don't know, is the fuzz really hidden? But I like this length of pant, right? Like, that looks cool. Yeah. Oh, my God, I love that. It. it looks like, for some reason, you have broken feet. Like, looks like they're in, like, medical Are they a size too small? I yeah. I got a 43. Yeah, no, they do kind of look like that. Oh, when you get a cast. Yeah. It's giving because of the fuzz. It's the fuzz, dude. No, I yeah, think it's your socks. No. So then should I wear a different color sock? Should I wear a blue sock? There's so white or something. I don't know. It is a vibe, but what's wrong? Something's wrong. I try it with no sock. One, one with no sock, maybe. You like this hoodie, though? Yeah. Cute. You yeah. kind of talked a little trash about it when I got it. Well. You straight up did. <laughs> I just didn't understand why they're so popular. Because they're... Like, no, I know, but I just thought, like, Russell Athletic was, like, no. so basic or easy. Like, it's I would probably could just go get it in no. Walmart or something. You, maybe. No, not, not for the Wait, night. something is right about not those perks, no? You guys can't really see them, but... Okay, stay in the top portion of that, because I just have a couple pants I want you to More try. Pants? I got you leather pants. Not good. Babe, I just want to see. Stop. Uh, leather pants. Yeah. Why are you so mean? Why don't? Why wouldn't you like leather pants? Oh, wear leather pants. Your hair looks nice. Thank you. Those are nice. Yeah. Where's your shirt now? Yeah. Okay. See everything in my pants. You don't love? No, uh, I think they're alright. Alright. Like when you wear it. It's a little like kick flare on you. Yeah. Put the put my boots on. Mm hmm So do you like them? Yeah, they're not bad. Okay. Now try Leather this. pants, everybody loves it. Try this. Leather pants. Try this hoodie on? It's just a little small. Okay, it's okay. It's okay. I feel like you're feeling trapped or something. I'm trapped. <laughs> but remember we were kind of vibing with like Yeah, small a little like more pants, more like, fitted. Like, yeah, no, this is pretty good actually. Try, try these, but I think they're gonna be too big because look at them. this hair, dude. Looks nice. I got these cow print jeans from BDG because we love cow print. We love BDG. I always size up one size in BDG because they run really small. And maybe they're too wide. These wide-leg. are really tight. These are too wide, like I think. Mm -hmm. These fit really nice, but yeah, I'm normally a 24 in every other brand. And these are 25 in BDG, and they're honestly tight. Another awesome BDG jean. And then I got a black pair. It was a little distressing. Actually, I don't have any black BDG jeans. I don't like this pair. These are not. They're cute, but if you feel like they're too wide legged or something. Look in the back, it's cute in the back. This flare's a little too much in the front, like down by the... Too much for you. I tried the famous V-dip jeans from BDG, and they're not for me. Like, they're just doing my body type no favors, I don't think. They could be really cute on other people, and I get the height. I'm wearing full of underwear too, so it's great for a denim kind of. But yeah, they're just not for me. They're not right. Let's see how tight they are for 25. This pair is like cargo style, very baggy. Think of me. You gonna be into these? Or like a snap button. Oh, cute. Good. Underwear. Okay, these are cute. I like these. Like a khaki, wide leg, baggy cargo pant. Really comfy. They have like a stretchy waist. And again, still sized up. 
one in these. And then this is a little oversized sweatshirt. I don't know what I'm thinking. Um, it's from the Mayfair group. They sell it at Urban Outfitters now. How cute. I love this. I have a few more pairs of jeans. Two more pairs of jeans. One more fleece of flannel. And then I want to try on these overalls, these knit overalls. Alright, I'll be back. Bye. Alright, this is the low rise pair of denim, which. Oh no, I don't know how I feel about this. Oh no, this feels weird. It just doesn't feel right. Oh no. I just want to pull them up so bad. I don't, I don't know if I can do the low rise denim. What's going on? I feel really funny in this. Oh my gosh. What is going on? Wow. That's weird. I just don't think this is right for me at all. What is going on? Guys. What is going on? This is so short in the back. So short, I feel like my butt's gonna fall out. What's going on? These make me feel so weird. Like, Nostalgic, I guess. I don't think I can do it though. I want to embrace it, but yeah, I just I don't think I can. I really want the high-rise jeans on. I also got that cargo pant style in this color. Black, I think. Okay, these are knit overalls. They remind me of waders. Fishing waders. I should not be wearing them with this giant sweatshirt, but figures can't be choosers. I kinda love them already. Aww, how sweet are these? Oh guys, how cute. I mean, I literally look like I'm wearing waders. Wait, do I have them on inside out? No, I don't. Does that just go on the outside? Oh, I guess that goes on the outside. Okay, so they're a little, they're like knit, so they're a little see-through. I feel like I'd have to wear leggings or something under them, but that's totally like a little wintry vibe. This sweatshirt's absolutely not right with them, but I think they're cute. I don't know why I just did that. Aww. I love them. I got them in a size small. And then the last thing I have, this fleece. If you guys don't know, Urban Outfitters literally has the best fleeces. I like these. I should get these. It's a bad for me, Clayton. But this one spoke to me because it was checkered and just so cute. It has little smiley faces on it. We're gonna elevate our mood. This is a look. This is a bit of me, as they say on Love Island. I just need these shoes in my size. Okay. Yeah. Love them. I love this fleece too. This flannel just looks like a really nice color and it's kind of that lightweight feel. Oh, here's another bit of me. I really do need these shoes. In the green. Oh yeah, this is a look for me. You guys see my shoes? It's a look. Okay, success. A lot of no's, but a couple yeses, so hope you enjoyed that. Tommy Lee costume. Tommy Lee stuck around and became Tommy Blue. <laughs> no. I ain't Tommy Lee, I'm Tommy Blue now. It's been a journey to say the least. It started out black, obviously, and then it faded to this like gray. Some different colors too. It was like a navy gray. 
and it was kind of a vibe actually it was a little vampire-y if you will and then it has developed to this teal color now which I wasn't expecting so that was a little surprise a little Tommy Lee surprise and yeah he's you know when you have a face like that you can just rock uh, anything you're making me blush but <laughs> looks cute with your blue hair when you blush it was supposed to wash out you're actually blushing I am Oh. I it's Maybe supposed to wash out. It's supposed to be washable hair down. Can't wash those cheekbones off though, so you look fly no matter what. Thank God. <laughs> the only thing saving me. You got some new jewelry too. Like yeah. you, you be looking good. I had like a mini glow up <laughs> with the blue Together. hair. Um. Okay. Let's put camera on the dash. Digital dash. Digital dash. Don't look at the. Right. Literally, it's just not a vibe for you to crash this right now. But we just left a meeting. I just came with a bunch of salt on my lips. It's an exfoliation. Oh my god! That was scary. Oh my god, and he's going over there now. I came out with crazy These drivers. drivers are nuts. Everybody has somewhere to be. I mean, like, apparently for some of them it's heaven. Um, but yeah. Just left a meeting for Boyd. You guys know the back end of um, getting all this stuff together for a clothing brand is crazy. Like we just launched Holiday yesterday yeah. when we're filming this and then we have a meeting the day after for our upcoming collections and you just have to work on everything. Yeah, you have to work on everything so far in advance and then you still experience delays and you don't hit the dates that you want to hit still and it's honestly can be extremely like discouraging I yeah, would say. It's, it's hard. like it's we hard. have been working on stuff for over six months that we're like okay well, we've been working on this for so long so it's obviously gonna be ready right but then shit happens and yeah. it's not and it's, it's hard just, uh, it's just a constant grind Delaney posted on her story yesterday, I think it was. Hey. She said, uh, founders never sleep. That's the truth. No, like, we were busy before we owned a business, but this is a whole new level of just always something to do, always something to work on. Thank you guys for all the support on the holiday launch stuff. That was really cool, and I think you guys will love the pieces once you get your hands on it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we I don't want to lose of sight our, of one of our favorite drops. Yeah, mm -hmm. for sure. I was gonna say we don't want to lose sight of the fact that we're always so grateful for everyone's support in our small business. It's just our personal journey of being small business owners is <laughs> like we also share the just the personal journey of that which is you know not always the most glamorous and it is really challenging for us at times we just share our struggles and our personal journey with it to be raw and real with you guys and um, yeah that's just actually what it feels like sometimes but that is not to say that we're not grateful of course for always the support and the love while we are on that journey so yeah. Yep. It's just life. <laughs> Showbiz, baby. Showbiz. Why is this exit back? Oh my god, oh my god, I don't feel safe. I do not feel freaking safe. I literally feel scared. I'm scared. Oh, I'm scared. I'm scared. Do I need such a freak of a passenger? Holy traffic is no joke. And you are. No joke. Somewhere. I'm no joke. I'm a good You're driver. No joke. Secure. Take the exit. Get you to your right. destinations. Right. So far, so good. You're, um, you're like, uh, you're kind of like the car sensors, you know. Mm -hmm. You're almost like an extra car sensor. Mm -hmm. Use the right lane to turn it's off the hard west. An extremely sensitive one. That means I'm a fancy car, doesn't it? <laughs> 
fancy upgrade. I'm just trying to keep us alive, okay? You're good. Appreciate that. So now we have some time to spare because we're actually going to an event tonight for Emma and her collection with Waif. Which, what does Waif stand for? Where are you from? So yeah, we're gonna go to an event. We haven't been In to... quarters of a mile. To to right on to Vine. Tired of her voice. Oh. We haven't Siri been is so annoying. to... Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. I forgot about this shit driving up here. So yeah, we're, we're gonna go shoot a sunset photo, I think, at freaking 3.30 because that's what time the sun sets now. Thank you. Freaking D30. D30. Freaking D30. Um, thank you, Daylight Savings. And then we'll go to the event. It's a dinner, seated dinner, said today. They said we'll see you for the seated dinner event. Seated dinner. It sounds so fancy, right? It's like not mingling. It's like sit here. I wonder if they have name plates. Or whatever they're called. Place. What do they call those? Place mats. No. Name tags. No. Placeholders. Mm. They always talk about them on the Real Housewives because they do that at their events sometimes. So yeah, we might have those things where they put your name on the plate and tell you who to sit next to. I hope I'm gonna sit next to you. What if we don't. I'm out of here. What if they separated us? That'd be really rude. So I would throw a plate across. I would do some Real Housewives. I would real be housewives? Teresa. Babe, there's a person coming. You'd go Real Housewives on them? Yeah. I would flip the table. I'm going to hold you to it. <laughs> They're not going to split us up. That's what we're going to go do. Okay. I just got ready in the car. I get my Oh my gosh. Seems anything in the back still. It's nice back here. It's nice. Need you to chauffeur me around from now on. That's what you do for me. Can we get this tag? You should sit back here. This is I'd miss you. Presidential suite. Can you get this tag off? So we are just chilling until the sun sets. Fleek hair. I was just asking on my Instagram story what are the best tips for getting really slicked hair? I actually used to not even use hairspray, so we've we've made major improvements over here. Um, I would just use water. Not, not sure, not sure. So now I use hairspray, and I have like a little wax that I'll use sometimes too for like fine tuning, and that's really nice. But I just think that there's better things out there. Probably there's there's got to be like a secret magical thing. So if you know what it is. Drop it in the comments so we can all prosper. Alright, just shot in some various places in this parking garage. You know? You gotta... When you're trying to get creative, you gotta just use a lot of different spots that are in your within your reach. I mean, a parking garage isn't really a creative place to be in with, but it works. It's a great place to take photos. Not why. I just did another outfit change, and we have about an hour until the event. Fifteen minutes. We just go, what's like around there? Isn't there stuff around there? Can I turn on the light again? Go stumble upon. Remember the website stumble upon? I love that. It was like a random website generator. That was like, you know what that was? My oh, baby. That was the explore page. Of the internet. Before Instagram. Yeah, and it wasn't of social media though. It was just It was just randomness. Websites. That's literally what that was stumble. Yeah, it was because you like filtered by your interests. 
So it wasn't completely random. Right. That's funny. Oh, actually there was one more thing I needed. Perfume. Do you want some? Yeah. Where is it? In the orange bag, I think. Okay. We're staring at my boobs. Yeah. Is there a problem? No, there's not. Let's roll! What's the problem? My shoe is not secure. I don't know what's going on. I can't, I can't really get it off with these nails. Alright. Okay. The Noir 29. So good. Gifted by Shaughnessy. Shall we? Shall we? What's up? Let's go. You look cute. 